Hi guys, my name is Lacey Nicole and in today's video I'm going to show you the perfect look for a girls night out. I swapped out my traditional black liner for a fun and funky blue liner. It's a great way to incorporate color into your look without going overboard. So if you'd like to see how I got this look, then please keep watching. And also if you'd like to see more tutorials by me, check out my YouTube channel at youtube.com slash Lacey Nicole G. To start off this look, I'm priming my eyes with a nice white primer that will give us the full pigmentation of all the products that we'll be using today and it'll give us a nice light base to work with. Now go ahead and apply a nice light cream shadow to your lid. To give us an effortless cat eye, I'm adding a little bit of tape to my outer corner so we can really just blend away without having to worry about shaping our cat eye. For today's crease color, I decided to go with Cork by MAC and I'm going to apply that right into my crease with a big fluffy blending brush and this will just give us some nice definition to the eyes and be a great transition color. Going back in with a more tapered blending brush, I'm going to go in with this deeper brown color and this will really carve out the lid and make your eyes look a lot larger. I decided to add a little bit of glam to the look with my MAC Reflex in the color Translucent and I'm applying that right to my lid with my finger. For my liner today, I'm switching it up with my Young Blood liner in the color Lagoon and I'm just going to apply this to my lash line and wing that baby out. Swapping out your traditional black liner for a brighter liner every now and then is a great way to incorporate color into your look. If you're used to more of neutral tones, it's a great way to add it in without going too crazy so you can dip your toe in the color world and still feel comfortable in your look all night. Go ahead and prep those lashes for some falsies. I decided to go with some pretty dramatic falsies since this is a pretty dramatic look, so I'm wearing some really wispy ones. We'll go back to the eyes in just a minute, but for now I'm gonna go ahead and move on to my face. So go ahead and apply your favorite foundation. and highlight your face, I'm going to go ahead and make a little triangle underneath each eye and right down the bridge of my nose, I'm also going to add a little bit of highlighter on my chin as well and then go back and blend everything out. Don't forget to set those under eyes with a powder to avoid creasing throughout the night. ahead and bronze up the face so go ahead and hit your hollows of your cheeks your upper forehead area your lower jawbone and a little bit on your neck as well that'll really just kind of define your facial structure and make everything look a lot more contoured and defined a nice little pop of color to my cheeks I decided to go with NARS Desire and this is the perfect bubblegum pink color it works great on the cheeks it just gives you a nice little pop of blush by the way most of these products will be linked down below for you guys to check out so be sure to check them out to give your skin that nice glowy look when it hits the light I'm using NARS Orgasm on my upper cheekbones and right down the bridge of my nose and that'll add the perfect highlight so you look like you're glowing all night Don't forget to fill in those brows, it's very important when you're going with a dramatic look like this. Back to our lower lash line, I'm applying Cork, which is the same color we used in our crease the first time, right underneath my lower lash line and just smudging it from the outside and working my way in. Now let's go ahead and put some lips on. To line my lips, I decided to go with my Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Lip Pencil in the color Wicked. I'm just going to line those lips and fill them in. To make my lips look larger, I'm adding my Cora's Mango Lip Butter in the color Frost Pink. And I'm just going to add this in the center of my lips, which will add a nice little pop of shimmer and in turn make your lips look larger. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the bottom bar where you can find links to most of these products so you can pick them up for your beautiful face. And also don't forget to check out my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash G, so you can see more tutorials by me. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll talk to you all next time. Bye.